One of the most important parts of the physical examination of the lymph nodes is to cut your fingernails. Because especially when you feel in the armpits or the axilla, you have to do it firmly and it hurts. But it will, you, the patient will appreciate if you don't have long fingernails. And I always cut my nails before clinic. You can look at it and inspect and see that there is a concavity on each side, and that's reassuring. But finding lymph nodes in the infraclavicular fossa is almost always abnormal, very commonly associated with breast cancer or malignant lymphoma. And uh, he has neither. And the way to do it, or the way I do it, is I put my hand on the shoulder because I don't want the patient to withdraw. Some patients are very ticklish. In others, it hurts, and the tendency is to withdraw or tighten up. And then you reach up. Now, patients are awfully very concerned because they sweat, and that's normal. And if you're a doctor, you're to accept that and wash your hands afterwards. And you go way up into the apex, and it's uncomfortable. And you just draw down along the chest wall. And as I do that, he can feel as I, have, I flip a few small lymph glands there. And usually a patient, especially in this location, will know when you have felt lymph nodes. And you keep coming down. More rarely, you'll find lymph nodes in the pectoral region. Almost never will you be concerned about lymph nodes which are lateral, that is, in the outer part of the uh, axilla, and often I don't even examine there. I will push my fingers, the dorsum of my fingers there, to make sure I don't miss something, but most of them, or almost all of them, are felt with your fingers immediately. When I'm over on this side, then I feel for epitropial lymph nodes. And the hand, the arm should be relaxed, and epitropial nodes are found just above the uh, <coughs> lacrinon and the only way to feel them is by rolling your fingers vertically up and down, not laterally. Because when you do it laterally, you'll find the tendon, <coughs> biceps, uh, triceps tendon, and the, uh, <coughs> and the, the nerve the ulnar nerve, and those things are normal. But when you go up and down, if you find something that you you know you roll, that's a lymph node. And or normally you don't feel anything there, but a small node, especially in a worker, is not abnormal. So we do it on the other side as well. We hold the shoulder down, we go way up. Once again, this gentleman has a small lymph node in his axilla right there. He feels it when I pull it. It's about uh, three to five millimeters, soft, of no concern. And then we do the epitrochlear as well. I feel his tendon easily. He feels it as I roll it. And the nerve is in there too, but there's no lymph node that I can.